Yes, Free Players TV, myself the teams, we're here outside the Emirates, man. The end result 4 2 in the dying, dying minutes, man. I'm here with Liam. What are we saying, man? Tell us your thoughts or oh, how you're feeling right now in this very moment. I mean, yeah, everyone's in isolation, everyone's excited, everyone's feeling great. Yeah, I was saying, um, I remember. Obviously, coming to the game, I thought it should be a straightforward one. Um, just well, maybe they might score because Jamie Vardy likes to score against us, but we kept it quiet. And um, I was quite pleased with that, but maybe there was too much attention on Jamie Vardy and not on the whole of the squad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To, yeah. Um, to squeeze two goals past us. Yeah, um, my manager in my group said, yeah, Vardy's going to score. We're just like, come on, man. Yeah. My man's old, man. My man's old. Sorry, man. Sorry, Vardy, bro. He is. Um, I think, still quick, though. He's a, he's a kind of player that maybe. Um, would have thrived about 10, 15 years ago. Like if, if he was born 10, 15 years earlier, yeah. I think he would have been a star. But now, I think when you've got centre backs with pace, um, strength, speed, is you've got you have something about you to be playing to that kind of age like Jamie Vardy. But um, he has done well this season, so he was a bit of a worry. But um, I think they've done well against him. Obviously, I think the underlying um, issue is that we let Leicester speed two goals past us. Mm. And I think, that has to be looked at. And, um, that, and that, remember, it was an early goal as well. Yeah. right early in the first half. Yeah. I think, what was it? Was it Saliba that... It was uh, a little the, miscommunication there or yeah. foul or whatever, but... I don't know, I think we got to do a little bit better. Um, the do you think goal, we were sort of like a little bit complacent thinking that, yeah, we're going to go into the second half, we've got this? I think so. And then, let's just, because they just came out of the blocks, didn't they? They did. It was like, already... It was like, the second one, you, you know, those goals happen, you know? You can't yeah. do much to defend against that. Absolutely wonderful strike by, um, and I don't even know, was it Justin? James Justin? Yes, yes, number yeah. two. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that was amazing. Right. Amazing goal. It's not the first one I'm a bit concerned about. Yeah, the first one. Right. Opportunity to now get back in the game. Right. And that's exactly what it is. And he gave the Leicester fans something to shout. Yeah, yeah. 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 Live in the market. Yeah. Uh, yeah. we're, we're, we're on the back foot a little bit, but somehow, and then I mean, Eve, what a play, came on, man just imposed himself. I really wish he right started. Right I really wish he had started. Um, um, Maybe it's good, it was great impact. Great I think Mikel impact. will say, he, you know, he, he got the best out of him by playing him in that way, but I, I wish he had started firstly because he just came with energy. And um, that same like drive, I want to see from. Um, other players. I, I wanted to see that from Sterling come in for the squad. Yeah. You know, I've seen Ethan come in and he just looks on fire. He um, nothing phased him at all. No, he he, he looks so comfortable. And you know what? There I say this, but it just reminded me, and I'll never forget when Wayne Rooney first burst on the team yeah. at the tender age of 16, yeah, whatever. And then he was just, he just, it was like he was just a big man on yeah. the pitch. And he just wasn't afraid to do anything. And that, this is just what I get with Ethan. It's not, I'm, it's I'm not time. saying that, yeah, he's going to do all this, but who knows? Do you know what I mean? The way the way he's, you know, imposing himself on the pitch and the way he conducts himself, the way how confident he is. Definitely started off correctly. Yeah. So you can't ask anything more from him at this stage. So I look forward to seeing his development. Yeah. And hopefully he gets many, many more years here at Arsenal. He looks good. He looks he great. Also, say, Liam, I have to say, how were you feeling? You know, because it was like the dying seconds, literally dying minutes, where we pulled up that vital goal back. Were you ready to cuss? <laughs> I was. I remember when looking at um, the clock and I thought, if it gets 85, maybe then I'll start panicking. Yeah. Um, but, you know, up until that moment, we were still knocking on the door and the keeper just kept saving everything. I knew, yeah, I knew something was slipping somehow. And thank God it did in stoppage time. When the ball went up with seven, I thought, I'm a lot more relaxed now. Yeah. And I was maybe five minutes quiet, I see late yeah. five on the clock. When I saw the stoppage time, I thought, right. Put it into perspective. We have loads of time. Don't panic. Let's keep playing the way we're playing. We'll get more corners, we'll get more chances, we'll get more did. Yeah, we did. We got two more goals out of it. So And also so, Liam, you took advantage of, of the uh, you know Man City, you know, they've been them being held today. Yeah, and it was a well deserved point for Newcastle as well. Well deserved because you can know, argue that, I mean we had another you know, another part I just mentioned about Rodri, you know, yeah. no Rodri. Uh, do you think that's really going to yeah. put a dent in the work? He's been, he's been key to them. I think them losing Rodri is, is, is 
way more vital than um, us losing Odegaard. Mm. Obviously, it's, it's Odegaard's one of our most important players, but for them, yes. Rodri is. I was Manchester starting City. to think that we were missing Odegaard at one point as well. We, yeah, we were. Um, today we didn't show it. Everyone seems yeah. to kind of step up and um, pull their way. But for Man City to lose Rodri, I think he's the best player in the world in that position. And he is one you really can't replace. So good luck to them. But got I think three points. You know, it really is our time now. And, and um, I think momentum, they are still top of the league, but I think momentum is. It's almost finished swinging into our field. <laughs> <So. laughs> the squad is looking good, man. And we've still got you know, another player to come back. Mm -hmm. As well as uh, Odegaard in our new signing. We're still waiting to, yeah, to yeah, see. It's, you know, it's exciting. Um, it is great. And yeah, to see Marino swatting that midfield as well is going to be exciting. So hopefully he's back soon. It shouldn't be too much longer now. But yeah, I'm excited. Let's see what we can win this season. I think we can win our cup this year. So let's, let's try it. Let's Say no more, Liam. Listen, I've got PSG next. So are you going to be here for that one? Yeah, PSG. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excellent stuff, man. Yes, big up, Liam. 3.2 v. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe to that thing. All right, we are now. Peace.